Hey guys and welcome back to another UK random video and today I have an unboxing it is Star Wars and it is from Smuggler's Crate now I've been looking at these boxes for a long time and I never bought one um, to be honest I don't even think I've watched a Smuggler's Crate video in a good few years now this came up on my feed on Star Wars Day a few weeks ago, and I thought, you know what? What the hell? They had the discount, it was like 40% off plus two bonus items. So, yeah, that got me. I went on their website now. They do have three different boxes, they've got a subscription that you can do every month, or I think you can even do every quarter if you choose, or you can get a one off box. Now, they do the Jedi Knight box, which is five plus items uh that one's usually 30 pounds they do a jedi master box which is seven plus items and it's 40 pounds a month or 40 pounds as a one-off and they also do the collector's edition which is 80 pounds now i think i went for the collector's edition now bear in mind they had 40 percent off plus there was two bonus items so technically this one should have 10 plus items plus an extra two so there should be at least 12 items in here all sorts of different star wars goodies i have got no idea what to expect i am going to get straight in it what i'm going to do as i am going through each item I'm going to try and find rough values for these items. I'll probably go on eBay or wherever and see. There's a first look at the box. It looks like there is a Star Wars Funko Pop. There is. You know what? It's one that I don't have. I did have it. And I gave it away a long time ago. So it is Zori Bliss. Um, flipping egg. I I must have given this away donkey years ago. I remember I done my A B well A B C of Funko Pops, and this was my Z or Z. Um, yeah, you know what? It was a cool pop, but it wasn't a character I was excited about at the time. But now that my collection's grown so much, you know what? It's not bad having this to put back in the collection. Now, <clears throat> value wise on this. I should really go to TPD. Uh, 311. All right, Zori is worth, is only worth a fiver. But you know what? That is not a bad start. Now, I think, like I said, it was 80 quid. I must have got it for about 50, um, give or take. Whatever. Now, the next item. Oh, what's this? Refer and earn. Earn cash for every friend you refer. You know what? I will put this in the uh, link below. Yeah. Um, obviously, you get a discount and I earn some points. Right. So, here we have... Okay, it looks like a tote bag. And it is a Mandalorian tote bag. Yeah, that will come in handy when the wife sends me shopping. I could look cool walking out a little with this bag full. Um, you know what? I'm not even going to bother looking that one up. Because uh, if they sell them online, they're probably about a fiver. So I'm going to put it down at that bag. Five pounds. So far, so good. Now, there is still quite a few items in there. I'm going to get the same small. I can see the top. You know, I'm just going to get the top one out. It is a plush. It is Luke Skywalker. It's a Disney. Teddy. The lightsaber does. Oh, and let's turn this around. Ooh. Um. You know what? The kids will probably love it, but I think it looks a bit... Eh. I don't know. What do you guys think of that? Um, let's have a look. 
Let's see what this could be worth. So on eBay, these are selling for anything between 10 and 15 pounds. I'm sure from the Disney shop, this probably cost a hell of a lot more. I'm going to put it down um, as... I'm going to just put it as a tenner. There's no need to go over the top. Oh, so, next. Ooh. I don't have this. It is a Funko Pop pin. It is Greedo. Oh, that is really cool. Um, I do have a few Star Wars Funko pins. I do like this. Um, I was actually bidding on a Greedo Funko Pop. I've mentioned before I'm doing a Funko Roulette where I'm bidding on a whole load of, um, well, I wouldn't say rare figures, but more expensive figures. And um, there is a Greedo one that I'm bidding on. So let's see if I do get that. Uh, yeah, I'm going to take a look on TPD. This should have a value on TPD. Um, ba -ba -da -bum, 04 Greedo. Okay, he's worth a fiver on TPD. Not bad, not bad. So, so far we're at £25 value. I've pulled four items, not too bad. I'm really happy with that because that's going to have my other Star Wars pins, which I haven't actually put on display yet. So now that I'm getting more, I can get a nice little display going. What is this? Okay, it's from Star Wars Episode 1, The Phantom Menace. Nice little art, bit of artwork. So you've got Darth Maul there. You've got Queen Amidala. Who else? Actually, yeah, you've got Qui-Gon Jinn, Obi-Wan. Yeah, that, that actually looks really cool. That is a nice bit of artwork. What do you think of that, guys? So, I don't know what sound that's going to cost. It ain't going to be more than a fiver. Probably a couple of quid. Um, I'm just going to stick it as a fiver just to keep it. Yeah, whatever. Right, okay. This is something uh, more for the kids. It is a Star Wars ruler. Let's go up to... Oh, it's two parts. Obviously, it came apart in the box. There you go. There it is. There's a Star Wars ruler with some cool... There's a couple of ships there. And the uh, Rebel logo and the Empire logo. Yeah, that's cool. You know what? UK Random 2 is going to like that. I don't really have much need for a ruler. What's that? Probably a couple of quid. Say three quid for a ruler like that. You know what? In the Disney shop, you're probably paying about a fiver for it. Ah, uh, stick it down as three pounds. But that's that's quite cool. That's quite cool. The next item is a Yoda keychain. Bit of glare on that. That is quite cool. It is a rubber keychain you know what that is actually a really cool key ring uh, let's see what this bad boy is going for on ebay once again it's probably going for a hell of a lot more on um well in the disney shop or anywhere that this is sold dun, dun, dun. Right, this specific keychain is selling anything between five and ten pounds. I'm gonna put it on the list at five pounds. I'm gonna keep this quite conservative. Um, no need to go over the top. I just want to see if I am getting my value based on what these are reselling for on eBay. Even though I'm not gonna be reselling them. It's good to know. Right, there is still a few items in here. Just having a little feel around. I don't want to look in there. Oh, <laughs> right. So we've got a Stormtrooper air freshener. Yeah, that will come in handy in the car. So it's Berry Blast. All right, so it's not that boring vanilla smell 
or that new car scent. Berry Blast should be very, very nice. Yeah, no, I like that. That's really cool. Yeah, no, I'm happy with that. Um, again, what are you looking at? Free. It's because it's branded, it's probably about a five. I'll put it down as three quid. Again, keeping it conservative. I'm not going to look it up. Um, we have a Stormtrooper notebook. It is a notebook, isn't it? There you go. Let me try and move that bit out of the way. There you go. So it's a original Stormtrooper notepad, notebook, should I say, uh, made from recycled paper. Always nice. It's all about saving the environment. Yeah, that's cool. It's obviously the same brand as the... I'm losing the plot. Air freshener. Right, let's have a look and see what this bad boy is worth. Oh, apparently these are ten pounds. Flipping out. That's a lot for a bloody notebook. But you know what? If that's what they're selling for, so be it. So here we go. Ten pounds for this notebook. Oh, we have a little Lego figure. And if I'm not mistaken, this is Kylo Ren. You know what? I'm going to build it now. <laughs> I love my Lego figures. Right, so. Let's get his cloak on. So there's the first part. So there, oh, there you have it. There's Kylo Ren. But not only that, you can replace the hair. And there he is. There's Kylo Ren with his lightsaber. Yeah, that is really cool. Um, what are you looking at for these? I'm assuming to have picked up at one of the events we usually go to, I'm probably going to pay about a fiver for that. And I think there is one more. No, there is a couple of other items. So you've got. Obi Wan Kenobi sticker. We have a Luke Skywalker sticker. And we have, as you just saw, Kylo Ren sticker. Do I add the value of those in? What are these stickers worth? A pound? I'm never going to write it down. And the last figure is Jin Erso. Ah. It's a, it's a Black Series figure from Rogue One. I do have quite a lot of Rogue One figures. Um, quite a few different Jyn Ursos, actually. And I've actually got another Black Series figure of her. Um, yeah, that, that, you know what? That's quite cool. Um, I don't really collect these, but, you know... Um, it's all right. Let's have a look at what these are going for on eBay. Right, so this one is going for anything between £13 and £25. That's not bad. You know what? I'm going to stick that down on there at 15 quid. So how many items did we get? Let's count them just to see. Like I said, it's supposed to be 10 plus, and then it's supposed to be two bonus um, things as well. Which were the bonus? I don't know. So we've got one, 
we got the notebook. That's two, three. The stickers will count as one item. So there's four. Keyring five. Ruler six. Picture seven. Lego eight. We've got nine. The bag ten. We have eleven and twelve items all together. So you know what? It's not a ten plus box, it's a ten box. And then there's two free items that they promise. Now you know what? This has actually been a pretty all right box. There was a nice, nice mix of things. Some things I like, which I'll keep. There's a few things I'm going to give away. Um, some things to the kids, some things to some friends of mine. Let's have a look at what the value of this box was. So we've got 50, 20, 30, 41, 46, 51. 61 so you know what i was very conservative with um value uh, well pricing it up um so yeah it could be more it's just over 70 quids worth here i'd say about 75 pound uh this box is 80 quid <sighs> is it worth it it is if you don't pay full price um like I said, they've always got offers on. I'm going to put a link down below. Go check it out for yourself. If you're watching this on a screen that's not your phone, try and scan that QR code. Um, well, you know what? Just use the link down below. I don't know why I'm showing you a bloody QR code. Um, and, yeah, see what you can get that box for. Um, always worth getting as a one-off. Would I get it as a subscription? Not the main box. Maybe one of the cheaper ones I would do on a regular subscription. Like we used to do with Popping a Box. Like we used to do with um, the Z Box as well. Um, it, listen, man, it was good. There were some cool things in here. I really like the pin. The pop's going to fit straight into my collection as well. Um, one of the kids will love this. That, you know what, <laughs> Luke with his light up lightsaber, that's that's cool. Um, the bag will come in handy, they always do, especially now that you have to buy bags when you go shopping. The key ring, one of the kids will like that. The stickers, the little one will stick them somewhere in the house. Um, that is going straight in the car. Notebooks always come in handy. The ruler always come in handy too. I might give it to UK Random too. I don't know. This I could put up in the studio somewhere. I do have some other Star Wars artwork. Kylo is going on display. You know what I'm going to put in with uh, my Lego Darth Vader. There you go. And yeah, do you know so a cool figure. I don't know if I'm going to keep this one or if I'm going to give it um, to somebody. Who knows? Might even do a giveaway. Stay tuned. Guys, let me know your thoughts down below. Have you had one of these boxes before? What did you think of it? Um, also, have you had the subscription? Every month, is it good? Is it pretty much the same stuff? Let me know your thoughts down below. Like I said, this box was, well, it's supposed to be 80 quid. I've got it for around the £50 mark. Let me know your thoughts on what you think of the value. Is it too much? Was the stuff no good? Some stuff's all right in it. Let me know what you think. Guys, if you have enjoyed this video, make sure you give us a like. Subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell. We're going to see you soon for another video. Peace. And may the force be with you. Thank <laughs> you.